This is the uh, 2013 Harley Davidson Tri Glide Ultra Classic. This is the 110th anniversary edition. So it came with some extras on it. I'll share a couple of them. My favorite that it came with are the chrome forks all the way. These look really sharp. And the fun thing about this bike, um, Harley made 1,450 of them. This is number, what, uh, 378 out of 1450. So I baby it, I take care of it, I wash it. And, you know, about a, once a month I add another piece of chrome to it. So here's some, some of the things that we've added. Um, this right here, these are called bat lashes, a bat brow, and this is the windshield trim. And those are all through Kirokin. Um, uh, the, the fairing, this is the bat fairing of Harley Davidson. It's a great looking fairing, but I just think this, uh, this trim and stuff adds to the contour. It really brings it out. I love it. Um, we added uh, peg extenders and the highway pegs. These are from Harley Davidson. And then if you look down here, this uh, elbow on the pipe is right at your heel, and I was getting all kind of the boot marks on the pipe. So through uh, heelguard.com, I, I ordered this heel guard, and it was a little spendy, but it's chrome. It bolts on. It's going to be there forever, um, and I love it. I have not had a boot mark ever since. Uh, then on the front end here, uh, I picked up these cat whiskers at the Sand and Surf in Ocean Shores, Washington last summer. Just a little leather to go with all the chrome. Um, we have the Harley Davidson dashboard and each of these little pockets are magnetized so they stay shut. There's one disadvantage to the dashboard and that is when it rains or I wash the bike I get a little moisture between the windshield and the dashboard but that dries eventually if I'm patient. Um, at first I was trying to dry inside of it and everything and it was just kind of crazy so now I just let it dry on its own. It takes a couple days. Um, these are the ISO grips with throttle boss and I really like the look of the chrome and the black on that. That added a lot to the bike. Um, we come on back to the rear fenders and through Kirokin I got this. It's called the fender accent and then we have fender flares and then on the back over here we have the Kirokin mud flaps, and uh, this is Kirokin. I forget what this is called, but it's just a cute little accent in a real bare area on the bike. So it was very inexpensive and an easy install. We have the Harley Davidson bumper, and then the same flaps, flares, and accents on the other side. And then uh, I got the little speak chrome speaker covers just to kind of bring out the speakers. And um, I think that's about everything that I've added to the bike, but I'm going to continue to add to it. The bike just turned 5,000 miles, and uh, in a little less than a year of riding, hope to have another year of about five to 6,000 miles this year, and good weather, good riding. Thank you.